Yo guys, what is up, it is Nick. Today I'm going to be talking about the upcoming For Honor open beta, so from February, starting February 9th, and I believe running till Monday or something like that, uh, we are having a For Honor open beta, and so once again I'll be playing and uploading gameplay from that. Uh, I'll probably try to do a few more live commentaries and a few more different stuff uh, like that. But uh, hopefully I can get some stuff out for you guys for it. Uh, maybe a little bit more live commentaries than post commentaries. Um, I was looking to see on the dashboard. They did have an ad for it before, but they don't have it anymore. But it starts February 9th. That's really all that matters. The game comes out the 14th. So I'd assume the beta would run through the weekend. And then we'll fire it up on Tuesday when the game comes out. But I do want to try to play some of that, do maybe a little 1v1s or 2v2s, a little bit more of that, opposed to the Dominion. Uh, maybe in this open beta we'll get the 4v4 execution uh, style game mode. Uh, I'm not sure if we're going to be getting that or not. I haven't looked too much into it, but I just wanted to let you guys know that the beta is coming February 9th. Uh, for those of you that wanted to play it and didn't get in on the closed uh, beta slash alphas uh, of the game that have happened, uh, this is your chance with the closed beta. Uh, or the open beta that's coming. Um, I'm not quite sure why the closed okay. beta is happening uh, the 9th because the game comes out the 14th. It doesn't make a whole lot of sense to me why they would do the beta now. They just had to close the beta. Um, if, the, if they wanted to do it, you think they would put the closed... They would have done the closed beta a week earlier than they did and then the, the open beta a week after that, giving them a lot of time to fix and address issues or concerns from the community and all that different stuff, but... I guess their plan was to do this open beta and then try to adjust these issues through quick updates and patches once the game initially drops. Um, I'm assuming none of the concerns or issues that you'll that will pose or stuff like that will be addressed on day one. They should probably be addressed within the first week of the game being released from the open beta, and then we'll start to address the issues uh, for uh, the issues that have been found in the main game. Uh, but the open beta should provide a lot more people into the game. Uh, I believe there was something like 40,000 people playing the closed beta, so we probably look towards 100,000 people playing the open. I know the closed beta wasn't it wasn't very closed. It was pretty easy to get in. Um, so I wouldn't expect the numbers to jump drastically, like an extreme amount, like up to 200,000 or anything like that. But a nice double up will probably, especially if Xbox and PlayStation and uh, Steam do a nice job of advertising uh, the open beta. Um, Xbox does a pretty good job, because uh, as soon as you log on, they usually show whatever beta is coming up. Uh, the big betas, I guess, because they showed the Blitz one, uh, but that's mostly because it was Microsoft's game. Uh, and they did show that For Honor open beta for a while up on the dashboard, so as soon as you logged on next to the main little screen, you could see it. Um, just real quick, the gameplay in the back room, I believe it's like a 12 and 2 with 8 objectives. Um, so not the greatest game, but it is it is a gameplay for me to talk over. Um, I'll probably go ahead and just do... I believe I have 3 more gameplays to go for the For Honor Closed Alpha. Uh, it was really a closed beta, but on the Xbox it was called a Closed Alpha. They were too lazy to change the title, so uh, that's why it's labeled a Closed Alpha. But I'll probably just go ahead and upload those, either as raw or just talk briefly over the beginning and then throw some music on after I talk briefly. But I wanted to get uh, in here and address the open beta coming up. Um, I'm not sure how much I'm going to play it. Uh, I do like it, um, but I'm not sure how much I'm going to play it. I've got some stuff going on this next weekend, and I've got some homework and stuff like that that I'm going to need to take care of. So it should get interesting. Um, it's not too big, of a, too big of a deal to record too much of it since it's coming out on... Uh, Tuesday, but I will try to get a gameplay out the 9th, 10th, 11th, 12th, and 13th, uh, so I will try to get stuff out for that. Let me see here. Is the 9th a Thursday? I think 9th is the Thursday, so it might come out a day earlier than I thought. Yeah, the 9th is a Thursday, so that's that's even better, uh, but I'll try to get out some For Honor gameplays um, from the open beta through those days um, all the way up until launch and then I'll probably do like a launch live com video or something like that maybe a half hour video or something like that uh, probably more of like my let's play videos where it's a little bit longer uh, to start out the the For Honor the main game um, so I'll probably be able to seeing as this video will probably go up either Saturday or Sunday I should be able to go through and get a video off the 5th, 6th, 7th, and 8th from the closed alpha, and then we can go 9th through the 13th for the closed, or the open beta. Uh, so that should work out pretty well. I think I have enough gameplay to do that. 
And I'm not sure when I'm going to fire up the Final Fantasy again. Um, I have plenty of content to upload right now, so I don't feel like it's too big of a deal that I need to get back to that since it's been on break for so long. But it will get back to I promise it. We'll get back to it, but uh, I feel like I've got enough Halo Wars 2, and now I'm getting back into Overwatch, and I've got all this For Honor stuff uh, that I don't think it's too imperative that we get back to the game that is already fully and complete on my channel. Uh, and then I'll obviously want to finish up the new game plus and all of that different stuff. But look for closed or open beta videos starting on the 9th, as well as I've got a ton of more Halo Wars videos coming out, guys. So keep a lookout on that. I'm going to try to make them last until roughly the release date. I don't think I'll be able to make it that far, but I do have a lot of content. Uh, so a lot of it may just be raw footage because... I don't have all that much to talk about post-commentary-wise, but I do have a lot of gameplay and all that different stuff, so I might use it to talk over or stuff like that if I have other topics or knowledge or something like that that I want to talk about in a video. Uh, but I don't have too much to talk about Halo Wars 2. Um, I might start to try to keep up on the news, so I have some stuff to talk to you guys about over that gameplay, but for now I don't have that much, so I do have a couple of live commentaries on the Blitz Beta to come out still. I believe one came out earlier today or yesterday, and I have another one coming out uh, here real soon. Uh, but I, other than that, I don't have any more live recorded things, which is what I... I really prefer to do live recordings. I'm not the greatest at doing post commentary. Uh, it's just not my favorite thing to do, um, and it requires requires a lot more timing if you're talking over gameplay. Got to make sure everything's locked and synced up and all of that different stuff. Uh, otherwise, it just looks stupid. Um, and then I feel like live is better. You get my initial like talking points and all that different stuff. I am gonna have some Tom Clancy's The Ghost Recon Wildlands. Uh, I don't think I'll do more than one or two, maybe three videos on that beta. Not my favorite thing. Uh, so I'm not quite sure how much of that we'll have. But I will have a couple of that as well as my thoughts and impressions on the game and what I thought. Uh, as well as probably a live commentary over it playing solo, just trying to check it out a little bit. But I don't think I have much else to talk about in this video. Just want to let you guys know about the open beta coming up for For Honor starting February 9th. Uh, I would assume... It would either start in the morning, roughly 6 a.m., or probably roughly in the evening, around 6 p.m. Eastern. So just keep that in mind. Um, if I see an official release time, which I hadn't seen yet, uh, I'll let you guys know. But it's February 9th, about 12-hour difference on whether and when it's released or not. So keep that in mind. But guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, I will be back with more For Honor, Tom Clancy's Ghost Recon Wildlands, and all different other games. Uh, as we wait for the full release of For Honor, as well as the full release of Halo Wars 2. Uh, so I will catch you guys all in the next video, guys. Peace out. Looking down from